I like to say it's the most normal thing about me, is my transition. More than 20 years ago, I spent a lot of time in San Francisco. There, I shot the film Gender Knots with and about the pioneers who were on a journey through shifting identities. Now, I'm visiting my protagonists again. As far as I'm concerned, I'm a man. Everybody who meets me just takes me as a man. I, I live my life as a man 24-7. I'm, I am a man. At some point, you really feel like it's happened. When I was in transition, I thought it was interesting to ask the question, what is my sexuality likely to be like later? And I had no idea. And I thought about it and I decided I didn't care. <laughs> Because once they know you, once they like you, and they see that you're basically just the same as them, sort of a little guerrilla marketing for trans people. I call San Francisco the clitoris of the United States. It's very tiny. It is surrounded by water. It's very electric. It's become a lot whiter and a lot wealthier. Um, so many of my friends feel like they can't afford to live here anymore. People oh, I would never be able to afford to buy a house yeah. here. So this has been a real sanctuary for a lot of artists. We have dinner parties, so it is kind of a Sprinkle Stevens salon. Some people never give up searching. They never give up adventuring, questioning. That's a journey that they take all their lives. And they are always going to be gender knots.